Tomb Raider. Do -do 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 -do. Yes. You can't have it. You can't have it. Let's do it. I'm just afraid I'm gonna pop out. So are we all, then. <laughs> so are we all. Video games are awesome because you get to do cool things with cool people. But what if we actually were cool people doing cool things in real life? We're gonna be trained in three different classic Lara Croft scenarios. The first is the long jump, jumping from one platform to another platform. The second thing we'll be training in is archery. And the third thing is jujitsu grappling, specifically a jujitsu takedown. Lara oftentimes has opponents that are bigger than her, and so she has to grapple them to the ground and punch them in the face. Today we're gonna train like Tomb Raider. I'm Angelina Jolie. You're Alicia Vickers. That one. Badass archaeologist ready to raid some tombs. Who shows a lot of skin. I think you need some shorter shorts there. What? Not short enough? No. Oh, no. Let's go raid some tombs. <laughs> Right now we are at the Tempest Freerunning Academy, South Bay. I'm Sydney Olson, I'm a professional parkour and freerunning athlete, and today I'm gonna to be teaching you guys some Laura Croft Tomb Raider moves. Woo! So excited. Oh my god, this is jumpy! <laughs> yeah, this is springy, I'm already feeling it. So she has to jump from one obstacle to another a lot, flinging herself and her legs are out of control. It doesn't make sense, but it looks cool. Yeah, it, it does. It looks great. Just like this midriff. <laughs> <laughs> what do you wanna keep in mind when you're jumping through the air like that? The eyes are key. Like where you're looking is where you're going to land. And as you land, you're gonna try and take impact away from your knees by putting your hands down on the ground. Superhero landing? Yeah. yeah. Which we could also do. Whoa. First thing you guys are gonna do is you're gonna run from that platform, taking off of one leg, and just land together with your feet on the mat. It looks farther than I thought it would be. Yeah. Go for it. Are you sure you don't wanna go first? We'll go in reverse age order. Age before beauty. Age before beauty. Hmm. <laughs> run, jump, run, run, run. Okay. Pretty good. Was it good? Long. It didn't feel good at all. That was great. Yeah! <laughs> that looked actually pretty cool. You guys think you're ready to take it up at height? Ooh, oh, uh, I think we're ready. So over there, you guys are gonna jump from the platform that has that little fence down to that lower one. What? Yeah. Once you fall, try to, to like get out of control with it, you yeah, might actually okay. fall off. Honestly, you guys will be totally fine. Unless you're not. Oh, I'm gonna die. Oh, that's high. Yeah. That is high up. I know. And we're gonna jump across this cliff. <laughs> yeah. What? There's really no difference in the jump at all. It's about the same exact distance. It's actually easier on this one because you're a little bit higher up. If you, oh you know, study God. physics at all, it definitely makes sense. Yeah, I, I studied <laughs> physics, Sydney. It doesn't mean I can he do went it. To Yale. If we don't, for whatever reason, jump far enough. We'll like fall a long way. I don't want to be a Tomb Raider. I just want to wear short shorts and dance in the desert. Three, two, one. Ah! Perfect. <laughs> Tomb Raider. You've got it. It's no different than down there. No different. Laura Croft, Tomb Raider. Let's do it. You guys did amazing, and I would think, yes, you can go right a tomb because you can do the coolest thing, which is jump across a building. That was so exciting. I've never done anything like that. So I was feeling pretty confident. I faced my fears, and it was time to go shoot some bullseyes. But you may know from seeing a Try Guys video that I had a really bad knee injury. It's still giving me problems. So before my baby came, I wanted to get knee surgery to take care of it. I'm at home recovering from knee surgery, but Kelsey gave me a puzzle box. Got a little hole in the center. But what Kelsey doesn't know is I'm amazing at puzzles. Hi, I'm Virginia Hankins, and I'm an archery coach with USA Archery. Because Ned is weak and is having knee surgery, I will be the only Lara learning archery while our other Lara is doing the puzzles. When we're gonna be holding the bow, this would be the shoulder height that we're working at. And make sure you're not blocking it out. There, the backhand is gonna have three fingers. Hunger Games. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> this hand goes on the corner of the mouth. You slide your hand as you pull into your back. Okay, so we're not gonna like You ready to try it with real bow? Yeah, I'm ready for the weapon. <laughs> Like, is it a toy? 
the knob clips on underneath the brass beat. Oh wow. You're gonna be lifting your hands towards the target, pulling back to your face, aiming lower than you think you need to go. When you're ready, let the arrow go. All right, we got a I did it, thanks! <laughs> <laughs> do, 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 do. Really just wanna break it with a hammer. You probably release some evil zombie spear. It looks like looks like this part slides up. I just moved it a little bit. Did you see that? That's red, that's even better. I did even better the second time! Now maybe this thing slides under. <gasps> Look at this! This part's gonna slide under. This piece is fall out completely. <gasps> Getting faster. All right. Okay. Yeah, that means I can pull this part out. <laughs> Yay! Tomb Raider. That's better. Woo! <laughs> that is how you killed one. Uh, 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 uh. That's <laughs> dead, son. You know what? If that was a human being, I probably would have gotten somewhere on their body. A torso is about that size, right? I would have gotten it. She left me a little note. Hmm. <laughs> Why did you? Took you long enough. Last, we went to a UFC gym to learn jujitsu grappling and a takedown. A week later, my physical therapy's going great, so I was ready to dive right into jujitsu. How long does it take to get a black belt? I've been training for 30 years. 30 years! So we're gonna be training for one hour. We'll show you two different variations. We'll go one go for the legs and one to do like a high throw. So one of us is gonna take the low road and one of us is gonna take the high road. <laughs> Up top! <laughs> hey, I got knee surgery. You can see it's shaven and swollen. I'm gonna be doing the easy stuff and Kelsey's gonna be doing the hard stuff. My doctor doesn't know I'm here. All right, so our first take down, I'm gonna drop my lead knee up here. Whoa. Control, base right there. I wanna hug his leg, lift up his leg, and use my head. Whoa. And I'll take him down. So this is down. all a takedown that I can do with an injured knee. Yes. So like in Tomb Raider, I've been shot. I'm like barely alive. You can still do it. Okay. Okay. Over here. Oh God. <laughs> Drop it. Boom. This like this. Ah! Let's, let's tag out. Let's tag out. Go 2018. Okay, so now this takedown is gonna be more like an under the arm throw. Okay. Oh. Ready? <laughs> ah! Okay, how do I? There you go. Control. Okay. Go under. Okay. Drop my knee. <laughs> and then throw. <laughs> that was kind of fun. It was like tumbling. So I'm coming towards you. Right here. Outside hand. There you go. You're gonna go under. Now control my arm the whole time, okay? Drop to your knees. Nice. Beautiful. Yeah! Woo! <laughs> that felt good! So I'm gonna try a chokehold. No, I don't wanna actually choke I want you. you to actually go squeeze, I'll tap. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, I will. Good, 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 good. Oh, wow. So like, how close to passing out were you just then? Almost, it was, once it's tight, I'm gonna tap. I am shocked. And then uh, things got a little heated. We should just like fight each other. Us? I think, I think you can. Just gotta believe in yourself, Alicia. I mean, I can, I don't know if I should. You know what, we've been playing nice. We've been saying it's not a competition, but you know what? It's a competition. You're on, Kelsey. Now, the two Tomb Raiders, using everything that we've learned, we're gonna fight each other. Ready, let's go fight. Ned put up quite a fight for someone who was injured. I tried to get him in, in an arm lock. He was not gonna go down without a fight. It's my arm, Kelsey. It's my arm. So eventually I had to switch tactics just to end things. So I choked him. Trying to stay in there, but man, I was seeing some stars. I thought you were gonna break my arm, but 
Then you choked me out. Well played. Yeah, the arms. Well played. I did not see that coming. <laughs> Way to go, Kelsey. You didn't do any brain teasers, but you're still smarter than me. Now I'm the undisputed jujitsu champion yeah. of us two. I had a lot of fears going into this video, but it was actually really fun. It was awesome to jump across a distance that you don't think you can make, just such an adrenaline rush. Beyond cosplaying and dressing up as them, it's kind of fun to do the activities that some of these characters can do, and you can easily do them. You can go to an archery range or sign up for a jujitsu class. Comment below what we should train like next.